Good afternoon. I have a real treat for everybody today. Um, we're here outside of Sinking Spring, Ohio. Uh, Eli and Maddie Stutzman have been gracious enough to allow Rachel and I to see their see their place. And you know, for once, I'm not visiting a bakery. You know, you've probably watched me gain weight doing these videos as I keep stopping at bakeries. This is something really neat. They have a basket shop, um, and we'll put the address in uh, under the video, but they've got a basket shop here. Um, it's a beautiful spring day. You may hear Purple Martins in the background. Uh, why don't you pan over and show the, the houses? Okay. Purple Martin houses. It's very peaceful out here. Anyway. You know, it's ironically the the home of the Longerberger Basket Company is probably only about a hundred miles away from here. But don't don't you know the, you don't these are wonderful baskets. Um, so if you want baskets, don't go there. Come here. I'm going to show you. Um, and they make these baskets all by hand on the premises. Um, come on in. You won't believe it. It's just beautiful. I'm excited about it. I don't usually get excited about baskets, but these are. These are exciting. Um, they've got over 80 varieties of baskets in here. And I don't even know where to start. Um, we'll come over here. First of all, just pan at the whole shop. I mean, it's not very big, but it's crammed with baskets. Um, and yeah, there are a few few food items if that uh, Maddie puts out here. Homemade pizza sauce and... Uh, pickles, strawberry jam, but these are really neat. These are Lazy Susan baskets, and uh, you can see the way they spin, or I can just leave them alone and they'll spin, like that. Um, and then if you come here, this is really neat. This is a, a double pie carrier. So, you can see this. Put a pie on both sides. Um, one of the neat touches to almost all the basket work in here is that they put the which child they had. The Stutzmans have eight children, and this was made by Ammon Stutzman, age twelve. You can see it's written on the bottom, so that's kind of a cute personal touch. Um, let's go over here. This is an example of some of the custom work they'll do. Like if you want a basket, you know, whatever you want, and you come, you can come here and tell them your specifications, and they'll make it for you. This was somebody who wanted a filing cabinet, a handmade filing cabinet, and uh, you can see it's pretty neat. Um, and okay, this is one of my favorite things. I don't know why. I just I just like it. Clothes hampers are big and bulky, and this is one that is a corner clothes hamper. Fits in the corner. Yeah. Just pan down the aisle and just baskets of all, all types. Let me come back here. I'm a little overwhelmed with baskets. Don't even know what to show you. Just take in the different craftsmanship. This is a basket that was made by Chris Stutzman, age 10. And come back here. Okay. So you can see this is um, you know, any basket you could possibly want. They're open six days a week. Year round, right? Year they're open year round. We're closed on holidays and Sundays. Closed on holidays and Sundays, um, so keep that in mind. And you know the the Stutzmans would sort of welcome the business. Just I always tell people, just be respectful when you come to any on any Amish owned business, just like you would at any business. Don't uh, take pictures. Don't uh, you know? Just just come and enjoy the beautiful scenery, and uh, be courteous and respectful, and you'll have a really nice visit here. Um, I'll put directions on the website, and um, and yeah, if, if you. Want any basket, they've got any type you could want here. Thank you.